Hey, it's a new year and a new me. Just kidding, it's still 2021 and everything sucks. But, got back from Costco, right? Paleo pancake mix. Birch benders, right? This is like my fifth bag. This stuff is awesome. It says almonds, coconut. Here, watch, 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 watch. Here, read, you read. I don't want to read, you read. There we go. Look at that. Cassava starch, coconut flour, almond flour, eggs, and some other stuff. Anywho, I've been making this stuff a lot and I like it. I like it because it's paleo, right? Because it's lighter on the stomach. It has protein in it. Seven grams of protein. And it's incredibly easy to make. And it tastes good, okay? So that's the most important thing, it tastes good. Here's the instructions. But I don't follow that because I just don't want to. I like to use a scale, watch. I like to take about 70 grams of mix, give or take. And then I just add water until it gets to the consistency that I like. You just kind of eyeball this stuff. It's not a rocket science. It's not rocket engineering. Then I get my awesome pan that I'll be doing a review on later. Super non-stick. And at this point you can add butter or you can add coconut oil. I'm gonna do coconut oil. Turn to medium heat and cook away. Let this thing cook for a while. I want to make sure it gets nice and toasty on the bottom. Now when it comes to flipping it, if you use a spatula, that means you probably never went to a high school party or ever kissed a girl. Because real men toss their pancakes. Ooh -wee. Finish it off any way you like. If you got some maple syrup, you're awesome. If you don't, you can use yogurt and blueberries. And that's it. That's how you make a beautiful paleo gluten-free pancake. That's tasty and healthy from Birch Benders, Costco. Really great product, highly recommend.